Hey guys, what's going on? This is Sam. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you all how to get this beautifully designed countdown to WWDC 2014 widget on your dashboard on your Mac. So to do this, first start off by checking the link down in the description below. From there, you can download this. It should go directly to your downloads folder unless you've set up a specific folder when you download things from Safari. But for me and probably for most of you, it will go straight into your downloads folder. From there, double click on it and you may get this message that says, this is not from an identity, that's a very hard word to say, identified developer, then it forces you to click OK because your Mac thinks that this is some virus or something, which it's not, so go ahead and right click it, click open one more time, and then hit yes, for sure I want to open this file. From there, it will shoot you over to dashboard very quickly, Yes, I want to install it one more time, and it will take you right back to the screen you were just on. But at this point, the widget is installed on your computer, yet it is not available for you to see in the dashboard section just yet. So click the little plus button down in the bottom right corner, or the bottom left corner, I'm sorry, of your screen. From there, you'll see the WWDC countdown widget. Click on it, and then it will automatically be added to your dashboard. You can drag it to wherever you want. I just kind of centered mine on my screen, but that's just a personal preference. I just wanted to give a shout out to RB1RAJ who designed this. Great job, man. It looks absolutely awesome on my Retina MacBook. It's just such a great design. That's all I can say about it. If you enjoyed watching the video, as always, feel free to click the like button down below. And if you want to see more content from me, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on any great content. Once again, guys, thanks for watching the video. I hope it was useful and I'll see all of you in the next one.